And welcome on a rainy night. The heavens opened earlier and it just hasn't relented. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me in the commentary box providing expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And what we're getting ready to bring you is live action from Liga. It's Angers and they take on Toulouse. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And a look at the starting lineup for Angers. Well, it's great to see them playing with the front two, but for it to work, they need to have a good understanding. They need to link up with each other and provide a different set of skills. And so the four to lose. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. Merci. Bon match à toutes et à tous. And the match is underway. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Bentaleb. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. Musa Diara. Van den Bowman. Well, the home side have had more than their fair share of problems defensively this season. They have the worst defence in the league. Yeah, porous, disorganised, shambolic, just some of the words that... And a goal! Not wasting much time today. They strike first. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. And back underway, 1-0 it is. He's going forward well here. Bentaleb. Mendy. They do pass the ball with authority. Well, possibilities in the centre. Using his physical strength to shield it. And played in. Well, in fact, a good but straightforward claim by the keeper. Branko van den Bowman. Well, strong play here. Strength and control, a big part of his game. And the flag does go up, must have been tight. Franco van den Bowman. Plenty of options. It's a good looking ball in behind. Offside it is, but he needed sharp eyes to make that decision. Well, it's fine margins, isn't it? But in the end, he just went too early.
Nicely timed tackle. Can they get in behind them? Chance to cross. And they've given him too much space. And using his body to good effect. Oh, moving it nicely. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. And plenty of scope to be created in that wide position. How about the cross? Great block. And the referee has awarded a corner following that touch. Going short. Crossed into the penalty area. Well, it came to nothing in the end. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? An alert intervention. Branko van den Bormen. A danger here as he runs at them. Well, a shot from miles out. Oh, could have given them an even healthier advantage. Well, it's a good effort to extend their lead, but the game's still in the balance here. And coolly done in the end. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. And with that, the first half draws to a close. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. And there to intervene. Firing it in, and there it is! A two-goal cushion now, and they just need to keep the concentration. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. here and the ball is moving again Bentaleb clean challenge it is a decent looking attack here oh he's gone for goal and the keeper was up to the task A 
Now how about the short corner? That's a useful cross. That's all they can conjure for now. Thumped clear. Shot attempted. Oh, really close. Just over the top. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Amadou. Nian. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Nicely cut out. Well, the visitors have controlled possession, as you can see, and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch, and I don't think anything's going to change that. Well, just listen to this reaction. They're affording their opponents far too much time on the ball. They have to press higher up the pitch. Crossing possibilities. Well, strong play here. And the cross, some away. Well, following the clearance, it will be a corner. They favoured a short one here. And delivered into the box. Well, not the best clearance. And the cross not quite accurate enough. And into the last 20 minutes. Chance here. The well, last gasp defending, but brilliant defending. Amadou. Jan Valéry. And no luck keeping possession. Zakaria Abuklal. Kunu, perfect tackle. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Just can't get it past him. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Favouring the short one. Anthony Rouault. Very quick thinking there. Sima. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. And we've entered the final five minutes. Now well, they've given him too much space. Oh, and the crossbar getting in the way. And a goal kick coming up. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Bentaleb. And this is Gulam. He's going forward well here. Gulam. And that was a very fine read. And they deal with the threat this time. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. Well, once again, they were all over the place defensively. And I can't see them improving because their tactical understanding and positional play is non-existent. Something has to change quickly. 